Driving this bright red van is a nine-year-old girl. She seems to be having some trouble parking next to the gas pumps before hopping out with her dad, who was in the passenger seat. And later, he can be heard on surveillance video saying he's drunk and his little girl is his designated driver. He's 39-year-old Sean Weimer, and after spending a few minutes inside the gas station buying cigarettes for himself and a caramel apple for his daughter, they get back into the van, the nine-year-old again behind the wheel and dad back in the passenger seat, only this time someone is following them and calling 911. Just watched a van pull out of the Sitco gas station. A seven-year-old girl is driving it, and her dad is drunk, and he's in the passenger. Is the vehicle staying on the road? <laughs> She's driving pretty good. <laughs> I'm telling you, I... I I can't believe it. And when police stopped Weimer's work van, his daughter was sitting behind the wheel, propped up on a booster seat. And Weimer police say appeared to be intoxicated, but refused to take a breathalyzer. Through the course of the evening, he was argumentative to the fact while in custody that it was his right to let that little girl drive any time that he wanted to, that that was his prerogative to let her drive. When Weimer and his nine-year-old daughter were inside the gas station, Weimer calls her his designated driver, even his chauffeur. I've seen that customer here several times, but to have a little nine-year-old drive you around at 2.30, 3 o'clock in the morning, is just, it's disgusting. Weimer, who had visitation with his daughter on weekends, is now facing multiple charges, including felony child abuse for allegedly letting her drive on a public road. I reached him by phone this afternoon, and he says he was wrong, but that he's a good dad who made a bad decision.